hi all this is sampath welcome to my youtube channel in the today video tutorial i'm going to show how to change a valuation class of a material master in sap okay without any further ado let's get started in the first case i'm going to change the valuation class of a freshly created material first i will create the material from the transaction code mm01 press enter key enter industrial sector and material type press enter key select views enter organization data press enter key enter all the basic details in accounting one view of the material master i am going to maintain wrong valuation class just click here i am going to maintain 3001 valuation class instead of 3000 finally save the material master just copy the material master to change material master, I am going to use transaction code MM02. Enter transaction code MM02 slash N MM02. Press enter key. Enter material master. Select views. Enter organization levels. Now select accounting one view. Now I am going to change the valuation class. It's very straightforward. Instead of 3001, I'm going to put 3000. Now save the material master. In the second case, I'm going to show how to change valuation class of the material if already purchase order exists. First, I'm going to create the material master as usual. In material master accounting one view, I am going to enter 3001 valuation class instead of 3000. Now save the material. Now I am going to create the purchase order. Save the purchase order. Now I am going to change the valuation class. We will see whether system allows or not. In MM02 transaction, select accounting one view. Now I am trying to change the valuation class. Double click on 3000 press enter key yes now system showing valuation class cannot be changed choose display errors to clear warning message just press enter key click on edit to display errors select display errors it is showing purchase orders already exist to clear purchase order just go to the transaction code me22n enter transaction code slash n me22n press enter key Click on other purchase order, enter your purchase order number, click on other documents, select line item, now click on delete option, we can flock purchase order for deletion. Now save the purchase order. Now go to the transaction code mm02, enter slash n mm02, press enter key. Press enter key again, deselect all views, select accounting one view, press enter key, enter plant, click on right mark. Now we can change the valuation class. Now save the material master. We can track the changes. How we can track? I will show. Press enter key, click on Deselect all, scroll down little bit, select accounting one view, press enter key, enter plant, press enter key again, click on environment, select display changes, just to check the date and time. In MM01 transaction, I created material master, in MM02, I changed the material master, just double click on this line, here we can see the changes, world valuation class is 3001. New valuation class is 3000. In the third case, I am going to change the valuation class of the material. In this case, purchase order and stock both are exist. How we can change the valuation class? I will show how we can change. 
first i am going to change the valuation class without deleting the purchase order and without clearing the stock we'll see what error system will show go to transaction mm02 press enter key enter material master press enter key deselect all views select accounting one view press enter key press enter key here i am going to change the valuation class just click here select valuation class 3000 now save the material or press enter key yes it is started showing the warning message to clear warning message just press enter key click on edit select display errors now it is showing both purchase order and stocks exist for this material we need to clear both First, I will show the how to clear the stocks. There are several ways we can clear the stocks. Now we can see the how to clear the stocks. There are two prerequisites to change the valuation class of the material. First one is that there are no valuated stock of the material in current and previous period. Second one is that there are no existing purchase orders or scheduling agreement for the material. If contract exists, still we can change the valuation class of the material. In case of non-valuated but stock material, we can change the valuation class once we delete the purchase order. To clear the stocks, we can use the following movement types. First, we can use the movement type 301. We can move the stock from one plant to another plant. Once we change the valuation class, we can revert it back. 309 movement type. We can move the stock from one material to another material. Once we change the valuation class, we can revert it back. Apart from this, we can use the following movement types based on requirement. We can make the stocks to zero by using 562 movement type. We can issue the stock to cost center by using 201 movement type. We can scrap the materials by using 551 movement type. We can use the fiscal inventory zero count option 702 movement type. We can issue the material against production order by using 261 movement type. We can consume the material by using 541 and 543 O movement types in subcontracting scenario. Now I am going to change the valuation class of stock material by moving the stock from one material to another material. Now I am going to move the stock from one material to another material. I created the another material with valuation class 3000. Just enter the movement type, enter the movement type 309, enter the plant 1000, enter the storage location or AW1, press enter key, enter newly created material, enter storage location, enter plant, receiving plant and storage location. Now enter the Old material number, enter the quantity, press enter key. Now save it. Now I am going to try the change valuation class. Enter transaction code mm02, press enter key. Enter old material. For this material, I am going to change the valuation class, press enter key. Deselect all the views, select accounting one view, press enter key, enter the plant, world material valuation class is 3001, just click here, select 3000 valuation class, press enter key, still it is showing warning message, why because we are not deleted the purchase order, just press enter key. I am going to delete the purchase order. Enter slash n m e 
22 in press enter key click on other purchase order enter your purchase order number click on other document now i am going to delete the purchase order we'll see whether system allows or not click on the delete option click on yes yes system not allowing to delete the purchase order why because we are not did invoice once we did the invoice system allows to delete the purchase order now i am going to post the invoice enter all the required details press enter key change the tax code select calculate tax checkbox enter the value just copy this this is the total value including tax paste it here press enter key now click on simulate now post it now we can delete the purchase order once we delete the purchase order then only we can change the valuation class of the material enter the transaction code ma22n click on other purchase order enter the purchase order number click on other document select the line item click on delete option now click on yes now save it click on cancel now i am going to change the valuation class slash n mm02 press enter key press enter key deselect all views select accounting one view enter enter plant enter now i am going to change the valuation class 3001 to 3000 now save it yes now we successfully changed the valuation class just cross check once again in transaction code mm60 enter slash n mm60 check the material yes my material is correct now click on execute option yes we successfully changed the valuation class now we can move the stock back to my original material by using transaction code mb1b okay enter transaction code mb1b press enter key enter the moment at 309 plant and store location press enter key enter receiving plant receiving store location my material is this one now i am going to move the stock from this material to here press enter key now save it yes we successfully moved the stock to original material check stock in slash n mmbe yes we maintain the stock to original material in the last case i am going to change the valuation class of the non valuated but stock material in this case both stocks and purchase order is available we'll see how system behaves click on the valuation class field select the valuation class 3000 press enter key yes it is started showing the warning message as usual press enter key again to clear warning message click on edit select display errors it is not showing the stock exist but it is showing the only purchase order here see in the mmbe stock is exist for this material now we are going to delete the purchase order to delete the purchase order select the line item click on delete option click on yes now save the purchase order now i am going to change the valuation class go back to material master click here select the valuation class press enter key yes now it is allowing to change the valuation class now save the material check it in mm60 press enter key yes valuation class is successfully changed thank you for watching 
if you find this video helpful don't forget to like share and subscribe see you in the next video